what's going on guys hey you guys remember this bridge right here look I got my magnet that I left behind my 2625 pound pole yeah I am here trying to retrieve it so you see that right there here it is it's stuck between the two big huge boulders inside the water so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put on a jumpsuit um, so I don't get all screwed up and stuff. I'm going into all this wooded area. I'm going to actually repel myself off of the cliff to get this magnet. So, stay tuned. Alright guys, what I did was I tied off this stick right there. I'm trying to get over that tree right there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to throw it from this side over there into the water. So hopefully, <laughs> hopefully I can get it with my grappling hook on that side so I can pull the magnet that way and uh, retrieve it so here goes nothing all right so now I can retrieve it from right there in the water hopefully <laughs> if I did that correct I'm hoping I did What do you think? You think it's a good idea? You think it's a good idea? Repelling myself and going down there? Huh? I got my jacket right here. What I'm doing is I do magnet fishing for YouTube. And my magnet got stuck between these big huge boulders <clears throat> magnet fishing magnet? yeah it's good for the environment like you're pulling all the metal stuff out of the water oh, okay. you ever see it before no no yeah so it's magnet fishing anyways you throw the magnet in the water and you take out all the metal stuff um you know sometimes you find treasure sometimes you don't but you're cleaning the environment while you're doing it okay so I got stuck between these big huge boulders and now it's like I need to get my magnet back. So my magnet's right there. I just threw my rope in with a with a stick tied to it. Sure, sure. So you see the rope right there? I tied my stick right there. You see my stick right there with the rope on it? My, you don't see the long stick right there? Oh, is it where the sun's shining on it? Where? No, over there. You see the long stick? No, but that's okay. I'm old and blind. Right here, hold on. Right here. Stand right here. The long oh, stick okay. coming out. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was like, you don't see that big stick? <laughs> but, yeah, see the rope right there? my magnet is stuck in the middle right there be yeah. between rocks so when I'm fishing off of the bridge I'm trying to pull it this way and it's stuck between two boulders oh. so now that I put my stick over there I'm hoping I have a grappling hook and a rope so when I go down there I can hook that with my grappling hook and then pull it towards me and once I get that rope I can pull the magnet this way and hopefully get my magnet back I don't think you should be doing it by yourself and I'm not going to volunteer to help you. <laughs> yeah, no, no, I, I, I get it. I, just, I, I would if I were you, but um, that stuff is dangerous. Yeah, it looks dangerous. It does look dangerous, I'm, I'm not going to lie. There's a shopping cart. And that wouldn't be me. That somebody had pulled out of here. Are you kidding me? Well, and, and, I'm, well, and I'm going, how the hell did they get a shopping cart? Well, they pull it out. There, there. They pull it out with a grappling hook. I got a grappling hook that I go in, I pull my stuff out, but if you watch on my videos, I take all my stuff and put it in the back of my, see the trailer in the back of my car? Oh, yeah. I have two bikes that I pulled out of here still in my trailer. I don't mess around. When it comes to like cleaning up after myself, I do a good job. Good here. I got, I, there was a, there was a 20 foot rebar 
and plus the 15 foot like street sign that I got over here I laid it up against the bridge and a scrapper came and got it so that wasn't a big deal do you want me to stand here or you repel and if you're in trouble I can call 911 not 911 but <laughs> well what, would, what if you're in trouble uh Alright. It'll be an interesting walk I had today. <laughs> Here we go. Take a second. Right into the briars. I literally got a thorn in my in my butt. Hold on. I gotta I'm good. Guys, I'm on this side of the magnet now. So, let's see if I get this. Come on, baby. Grab that. Grab that stick. Now, hopefully, I can retrieve my magnet. Let's see. This will be a beautiful thing. Yes! Come on, baby. You can do it. Check this out, guys. I have, I have my magnet. Woo! I got it back, baby. Yeah. Come on, baby.
retrieve them. Glad back. to see you back. Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna die. <laughs> Holy cow. That was that was exhausting. I bet. But you did it like you actually knew what you were doing. Oh, thank you. <laughs> I really appreciate you helping with the camera. Oh, you're quite welcome. Now, what did you say? You also get published in the Globe? What's that? You also get published in the Globe? I have a video of me in the Globe, yep. Yeah. Oh. Okay, you want it off now? Yeah. All right, guys, as you saw, I ended up getting my rope back. It, uh, it, it retrieved very nicely. This is Rosemary, and Rosemary actually offered to stay just in case anything happened, she can call somebody. And I'm very thankful that she stayed and she was able to record the different angles that I have. Yeah, thank God for Rosemary. She was on her six mile everyday walk that she does. She, she was seeing me and she was asking me what I was doing and I told her I was gonna rappel off of this, uh, this cliff here. And uh, guys, that's a 60, 60 foot rope and I was at the end of my rope, so <laughs> literally. So uh, I was able to retrieve it Thank God. We'll see you on the next video. Peace.